They surprise you? A little bit, but again, the matchups dictate who advances and who doesn't, Jim. It's not about conferences, it's about teams. And those teams play tough opponents in the first round of the tournament. Fraser with the steal. Ellington gives it up. Green, who waits and scores. In a team that just blitzed through the SEC, a conference that has produced champions. And here is Ellington reading it and going in uncontested. Back in front by one. Feed it down to Deion Thompson. His turnaround. That's his shot. Point. Yep. That's his shot. He loves that turnaround over the right shoulder. Allow North Carolina to get to a double digit cushion. And so far, his team has been able to do that. Watch out now. What a tough shot. He had Garrett Temple on him, who's a great. Suddenly a one point game. And Lawson hits his first jumper. Of Story of that trip. Yep, a 4 2 at his bounce. Here's Marcus Thornton with Fraser reaching in and stealing. Up ahead, Lawson. Up. Lawson with eight in the half, ten on the game. That's why he's the ACC. Ellington gives it up. Perfect pass this time to Davis. North Carolina would love to try to speed this pace up, but to do that, they're going to have to defend and defensive rebound, and they're going to have to be able to guard Tasman Mitchell effectively one-on-one. -on -one. That was careless and well played by Ellington, who leans in to trim it to one. Boy, and he got bumped. Lawson penetrating, cutting through his best move of the night. Well, you can see the adrenaline picking up. He jammed that toe. You got to try to get it to hands, bro, if you're North Carolina to put some pressure on Chris Johnson. Ellington Temple was all over him. I mean, defending him as well as he could without touching him. But out there by Danny Green to close out. Asmund Mitchell, a freshman on his back. And that is a turnover again. Lawson showing that speed. Puts it up with spin. Oh, my goodness. That was rolling off the rim. How about this, young man? Lawson. Oh, what a move. And a shot to pay it off. Tax through Lawson. Or post up Hansbro. Turn around. Hansbro hits the shot. His first field goal. Or here. 13 point lead, 220 to play. Yeah, and you're in the. You've still got plenty of fouls to give, already over the limits. Yeah, I think now. Yeah, Leroy Williams wants a 20 second timeout. He was trying to get it, although Trent Johnson may have gotten it. Time for the second tip of the night in Memphis. Gonzaga. Carolina. Let's take you there live. Jim Nance and Clark Kellogg. Pretty good pair of care of the basketball there. Very efficient and explosive on offense. That's Lawson. Puts up the three and knocks it down. He's tough. Threw it away that time, but typically stuffs the stat sheet in a positive way every game. That's now three turnovers on Gonzaga and Danny Green. Good on the third. Match up here now and Dave backing off of Lawson. See, he had to respect his ability. Up a little bit, showed some zone and man to man. They try to challenge shots with their left, but that time didn't get close enough to the sweet shooting Wayne Ellington. Boy, is he? That's his first basket of the night. The sweet shooter right here with the ball too. Gray. Goodson. Put it out high today. So you got to try to take Hansborough off the dribble if you can. Big shot, bounces twice off the rim, and right to Hansbro, who aggressively swings the arms and clears it for Carolina. Here's Ellington. Got fouled and caught the basket. Foul on Fargo. That's the difference, partner. Bolden tried for the clever pass. Picked off. Lawson hits the deck. Lawson driving on Bolden. Now shut down, goes back outside. Ellington. Step back three, and he's got nine on the night. Oh, my. What? Going to try to get it up on the rim at about the four or five second mark so you have a chance for a second shot if you miss. Hansbro got Day to commit. Puts up the shot off the glass. 
And we reach that back. And then the balance. He stopped on a dime there. Gonzaga really rushing it now. Yeah, well, Gonzaga has not hit a shot now to start the second half. And not even looking inside, Jim. Just settling for perimeter shot. Oh, wow, that is Lawson setting up Thompson. First six points of the half go to Carolina. Bolden, long with the shot. Boy, Ty Lawson really looks good. That's a good look for Green. Green's second three of the game. Yeah, he is so good trailing the fast break. When Lawson pushes it up and defenders run to the paint, when Green is the trailer, that's an excellent shot opportunity for him from behind the three-point line. Now got their largest lead of the night. It has swelled to 19. Carolina doing a really nice job defensively, not allowing Gonzaga to get anything really inside. Active double team here. Height felt trouble all the way. Big numbers for North Carolina. Bounce pass, Ellington lost him with another assist. How beautiful was that? The efficiency of it made it so good. And Lawson sitting down, but watch this little moment earlier. Watch. Yeah, look at the maestro. He knows he's got Wayne Ellington on the wing, slows up his dribble, and leaves it for him beautifully. Excellent on Lawson, both playing with three fouls. Is that right, partner? That's right. Yeah, so this is a um, critical stage here. Pargo has been very good getting into the lane. Oh, good call, good screen that time for Fraser. And Bobby Fraser, the senior. Wreck a couple of rallies to stay in control. They got the shot they wanted. Gray open on the wing. Now Ellington with that long stride. Can Fraser make it two in a row? Yes! Bobby Fraser! Unexpected six point boost in 26 second stretch. Pargo and Davis says, not this time. Up ahead, Ellington. And just like that, basket counts. Heading to the line. North Carolina open. Lawson. To Hansbro. And one. Coming up, Heitfeld. Lawson feeds it green. From the wing. And he's got three threes on the night. Thompson loose underneath. He had a shot there and elected to pass up on it. Well, maybe after all there on his first attempt, he thought otherwise. He's going to take this one, though, and he knocks it down. Hey, when you're a post player with his kind of shot. They say it was before the shot, so Carolina inbounds. Here's Ellington. He takes his jumper, and it's all net. He is on a roll for more than a month. Okay. Point line is going to have to really be a factor for his team here today. It's Lawson, he's past Johnson. He waits, he sees Griffin, so he kicks it out. Three-point shot, Danny Green drills it. Seven-nothing, North Carolina. Green back to Davis. Blake Griffin defending. Over Blake Griffin, and it rolls in. Ed Davis off the bench with a basket. Now it's Blake Griffin. Reach and stolen by Hansbro. Fourth turnover against Oklahoma. Lawson, pull up jumper. Yes, beauty. Double digit lead already. He gets his hands on it, it's his. Warren's pass deflected and saved in the corner by Lawson. Danny Green in the paint. Hits the shot. Hansbro is running over to check in. He's been sitting down for over four minutes. Ed Davis gets another chance. And Danny Green flies in, takes it away, and gets the put back. What an effort by Danny Green. Terrific effort to pursue that orange. And that's all offensive rebounding is about, Jim. Try to wear down Oklahoma a bit. Zeller snaps it over. Tyler. 
Blake Griffin went for the steal. Actually, it was Griffin. Yeah, it is. And actually, as my younger son would say, the number, the score is flipped, Dad. 32-23. Ellington adds to the Carolina lead and is back to 11. Lawson weaving, dishing. Thompson has two baskets to start the second half after making one in the first half. Well, that was all. Lawson loses it. Back to Thompson. To seal. Snaps it outside. Ellington's ready for it. And knocks it down for a three. Surprising number, the fact that Oklahoma is out rebounding North Carolina. North Carolina has gotten some second chance opportunities though and attacking this zone. And that's not going to work. They're going to have to go back to man to man because. Let's come back and get this team turned around. By the way, he's done that against North Carolina. Yeah, he sure has. Lawson trying to add to it. And does with a three. Well, I talked about it at the, at the entire half has been played between a 9 and 15 point Carolina lead. And Carolina comes up with the play. Taylor Griffin saying, wait a minute, where was the foul? Up ahead, though. It's Lawson racing in for two more. Just overpowered Austin Johnson that time. Ball, and then you want to attack here at about the 10 second mark. Get ready to execute your play and put it in the hands of your playmaker. That's Danny Green stepping up and banking it home. Perfect execution there, and you'd expect that from an experienced team like North Carolina. Gonna be the case. North Carolina too much. They start out 7 0 and never look back. Tar Heels win for the hundredth time in their history in the NCAA tournament a record and now a record 18th final four coming up. Friends, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Detroit for tonight's second national semifinal game. North Carolina to try to punch this ball inside at every opportunity. Cunningham and Hansborough, a lot of shoving in that matchup. Ellington, oh, that one went way up into the sky and came down true for Wayne Ellington. Carolina's first up here. They're able to hold their ground and they flick balls away from you. Lawson with the three and he bangs it home. It's all kind of explosive offensively. Big East sixth man of the year. Meanwhile, Ellington has another basket. This one a three. So both coaches trying to mix things up a little bit. Dana Green, he launches. Knocks it down, Dana Green. Well, he's been solid in the tournament. Like to space the floor and spread out the defense and then try to drive you on ball reversal. Oh, it's Lawson. With the steal in the basket. Drive and dish. And Ellington. And he, too, hits an outside shot. That's his second throw. Lawson, weaving past oh. three players. Thompson oh. inside and got it this time. Well, that's terrific for Sid. Next thing they've got to be able to accomplish in order to try to make a run before halftime. Danny Green got the feet set and another three. Ten him there. He's hit it several times tonight, but not that time. Now Lawson working it underneath. Back out Green. Three, yes. Danny Green. Well, they missed that when he was on the bench with the 3,000 in the first half. Look at that three-point shooting for the Tar Heels. Wow. Well, Villanova maintaining contact. Redding lost it. Up ahead, Lawson. Reynolds picks up a foul. The basket, they haven't signaled good yet. I think it's going to, it does, it can't. Well, Villanova's only chance is to scramble this thing up with a frenetic defensive effort. And they've got to try to do it without fouling. Davis with the basket. And a free throw coming up. Had a chance at it, but Davis takes it away. 11 straight misses from outside the arc. Here's Ellington. Not for the North Carolina side. His first second half points.
Anderson waiting, waiting, waiting. Clean block, Green. Clean block, Thompson. Wow. Carolina comes out with it. That's an example of what I mentioned a moment ago, the size of North Carolina really bothering interior shot opportunities for Villanova. And Ellington drains another. Hills rolling on the Monday night. Another convincing Carolina victory. <laughs> Championship night 2009, Ford Field and the all-time crowd to see the national championship game. Michigan State and North Carolina about to tangle for the title here on CBS. This Kaitlin Lucas starts out on him, man to man. Walton is on Ellington. Thompson with a freshman defending and perfect shot by Dion Thompson for North Carolina. Jim, he only took five shot attempts in that game. Jim, only one in the first half on Saturday. Made two of them. It's the three. Here's Green with one. And a swish by Danny Green. For the third straight time in the title game, North Carolina faces a Big Ten opponent. It's Ellington slicing through and using the glass. Mar Morgan had a monster night in the semifinal game Saturday. 18 points, nine rebounds, and North Carolina comes right answering back. And a steal on the inbounds pass. Lawson feeds Thompson at Sutton, reaches in. Boy, North Carolina is really on top of its game right now, Jim. With that prestigious Cousy Award. And I don't think many people watching the tournament would doubt that he was the most meritorious honoree. Without question, Jim. Ellington hits the three. And already, North Carolina, there's that opening run we talked about. But in transition, Spartans get it up ahead for the easy layup by Draymond Green. It's really pick your poison with North Carolina. I think Michigan State has to try to choke off the three-point shot and make this team a two-point shooting team. But right now, North Carolina making threes and making twos. Ed Davis, and this is where you have to be careful against North Carolina. Good job by Michigan State to choke off Lawson's penetration. But it's back to Lawson. He gets past Lucas, and he'll take the baseliner well short. Davis, though, race to the rebound, picks it off the floor and scores. And a steal right back by Lawson. Razor comes in, step up, three, no. But again, offensive rebound leads to two more for North Carolina. Wayne Ellington. Tough matchup here. Corey Lucas defending Ty Lawson. Thompson's got the advantage, and he's heading to the line for a three-point opportunity. Sutton on the foul. What His a second. Time. What a time for deep. But all... Sutton's on the floor with two fouls. Davis. Too much size for the freshman Draymond Green. Just threw it right over top of him. Ellington, he gets to that spot so fast, it knocks it down with a rainbow. Timeout. 12 points. 12 point win back in the regional final against Oklahoma and Blake Griffin. Down in Memphis. Here's Ellington. He's got another three. Feed it to Green. And that's a charge. Nothing to second. Terrific job of rotating by Deion Thompson. Gump between now and next season with strengthening and conditioning and playing more basketball during the summer. Ellington uncontested. North Carolina has a record first half total in the history of the championship game. No rush for North Carolina. Very content to just run through their options in the half court. And Man, got bro. Of them. Yep, hits the shot this. He called it. Trace Rill. And that slides off the rim. Rebound goes to Summers. Stolen. There it is, the record. That's number eight for Lawson. An all-time championship record. And Davis somehow got the shot to go. Almost tapped it in, volleyball style, and he's going to the line.
has eased off the throttle a little bit. Yes, they have. They missed their last five. But you can end that streak thanks to Danny Green. He's had a knack for doing that. Anytime there's been even a little drought. <laughs> I'm sure we'll see yeah. that. Oh, yeah. I'm sure, too. He's not going to let those kids down. That's what he said. I promise. Loss in the hands, bro. Well, he is so good at navigating. Just five of 19 this half. Under 30%. Hansbro. Tough shot. Improves the percentage and moves to number four all time in tournament scoring. Tony Green. The ones uh, really recognized tonight to govern play here at the championship game. Congratulations. And there's Lawson. And right in his hands. He acted like he had only seven seconds. Well, he saw the scene, Jim, and got right to the rim. He's so good. Here's Bobby Fraser. Let Fraser take it in. There you go. He was a starter as a freshman. That team that had to rebuild made all ACC fresh. Roy Williams Roy wants Williams to get just, his reserves yeah. in as well. Tyler Hansbro, look at that. Oh, there it Excitement. is. CB McGrath, give him a hug. Steve Robinson, another assistant. Holiday. And that joy. Look at that young man. Marcus Skinner. They've been together for four years. Hansbro has what he wanted. There's his father from the start that could not have been any finer. North Carolina is the 2009 national champion.